everyone hope you're all okay right i'm coming on today because i'm really excited <laughs> um yesterday uh the lovely vicky from crafting vicky put a video up and i was that excited about it i had to rush up to my craft room and do it straight away um she'd seen it from another lady i can't remember who the other lady was but she'd seen it from another channel where you get masking tape and put it on a sheet of acetate this is quite a thick one i've had some of this given me um or laser film something like that and then choose your images and print on it to make your own like washi tape so and if you go to vicky's channel I mean, if you don't know vicky please pop across because she does some absolutely she's a lovely lady and does some absolutely fantastic little projects and that she's she's really really good um but yeah yesterday in her video i'll leave the link to it she shows you how she did hers um, and she's used all fruits and she's used a program called photoscape oh, i've got a program called photoscape i didn't until yesterday i didn't realize that i'd got it on this laptop that i've got now but i knew i'd used it years ago um and she shows you how she cuts all she'd used images of fruit and she'd cut the images out and to make little so that they would you know fit on a page to make her washi tape and she shows you all how she does that on this particular program so if you're somebody that thinks or oh, don't really know how to you know work programs and that and this photoscape's a free program <coughs> excuse me free program um you know pop across to her and you know she'll she'll help you to do that sort of thing it's really good um so i thought oh that's brilliant because i'm quite into doing digital stuff and that I haven't done any for a while and i don't have any the programs I've used, I used to use Photoscape and then there was um, a program called Painter 10, I think it was, but it was a, th um, <coughs> excuse me, a month's trial. You got it for a month, so I played about with that and that's probably, I don't know, eight or nine years ago, but I've still got all the bits that I did with it. So I thought, oh, I'll use those. So I will show you what I've done. Some of them's better than others because I found out this morning that Mr. Doodle's printer's better than mine. <laughs> I was telling him, I said, oh, they're not very clear. He says, well, use my printer. So this was the first one I did. I'm still quite pleased with it. It's so pretty. Um, but because it's printer ink, uh, it's still still a little bit wet some of them are well these aren't i did these yesterday um but what i'm gonna do is leave them for probably i don't know three or four days a week or something and then see if i can seal them because i'm not sure you know how it'll stop on with it being masking tape i don't know what vicky's done whether she sealed hers but i thought what i might do was instead of doing it with a brush in case it smears it i might do it put some mod podge or something on my jelly plate and just do it like that i don't know yet if anybody's got any other ideas um but anyway that's the first one i'm a bit croaky today i've got a bit of cold coming today i think I feel a bit crook i love them I do. I've <laughs> done real weird stuff, but don't ask me how I've done them because I haven't got a clue. I just get these programs, and you know, I'm uh, where a lot of people say, "Oh, I can't, I can't do that." Well, I don't class that I can do it, but I liked. I'm not frightened to experiment with technology. I just love technology. Um, so, but I, I think the brill. I mean, these first few that I'm going to show you, I'm going to print them again on Mr Doodle's printer see if they come out any brighter and there's this one I 
this one. I love them. <laughs> and I'm so pleased that I'm actually using, you know, the things that I've made all those years ago. <laughs> I have done some cards with them from time to time. Right, my inky fingers look, they're still not dry from yesterday. But I think that's just the bits that's still on the acetate. And then these ones are from Mr Doodle's printer. Look at that! I think I did this one this year. Just love kaleidoscope stuff. Love it. That's that one. What's the other program I used? Painter. Oh, I think there were. I think I got um free download again for a month of Photoshop or something. But I I haven't actually got any. You know, full programs. But I wish I had. Because I just love doing stuff like that. that was a bit wild <laughs> yeah this was on uh, this was on the painter 10 because i can remember that i really loved that one and that one and they do come off all right i don't know what's what they're mr doodles don't know with his printer but I'm getting a border there or whether that's something to do with my laptop oh, well, obviously they're not going to come off now are they that goes without saying really but they do because I've tried <laughs> there Real pretty. Love them. Oh, and then I like I liked the kaleidoscope one, so I did another one of those. And then I don't know quite what went. This was Mr. Doodle's printer, but that's a very pale one. So I might just stick that in again with another pattern over the top see what happens to that but yes that's all I was coming on for so thank you so so much Vicky for doing that video I, I, it was just one of them got to do it now got to do it now <laughs> and luckily we've both just um, had to buy well not luckily but we've both just had to buy new ink for our printers so they've both got good ink in but yeah mine's mine's a Canon my printer's a Canon and Mr. Doodles is a Hewlett Packard. But they're still pretty because they're just they're just pale. So love it. There we go. So say yeah, just a sheet of acetate or these these ones are laser. Well just basically something that's not gonna stick. So there we go. So thank you very much for watching and thank you again, Vicky. And I'll leave the link to Vicky's channel and have a lovely weekend, everyone. Take care. Bye.